My learners will engage with and within my classroom context as physically, socially and intellectually developing individuals. In order to best serve my students, I must engage with these characteristics to guide how their development will affect their learning. As an effective teacher, it is my responsibility to critically analyse and understand theories of learnings such as behaviourist, cognitive, constructivist and social constructivist approaches and emerging research that extend my professional knowledge of how my students learn in order to inform effective practices. A social constructivist approach, particularly a sociocultural, sociocultural historical approach, offers a rich foundation for understanding the contemporary learning processes of my students. Aligned with Vygotsky's theories, acknowledging the role of physical learning environments and embedding learning in socio-cultural contexts that my students engage with, I'm able to facilitate learning to be a social and collaborative process. An understanding of the motivations behind my students' learning is also critical to how I can, how I can offer myself as an effective teacher. Understanding the role of social and emotional well-being, family interests and involvements in student learning, learning relationships and the role of supportive and fair classroom environments create interesting and relevant teaching, ex teaching and learning experiences that leave my students with feelings of safety, agency and a choice in their learning and a sense of support over personal issues and endeavours that is essential to me fulfilling my position as an effective educator. Understanding these factors that shape my students is critical to me being able to develop a practice and engagement that best serves these individuals.